Hello and welcome. I'm Scott Dennis. And I'm Jacqueline Matter. Thanks for joining us. Topping our news at 6, only four months after winning the Class 7A state championship, Venice High School has fired its head football coach. The coach is now blaming the firing on a rival coach in the same district. Here's ABC 7's Dwayne Lindo. Head coach for the state champions, Venice High, is now gone. John Peacock's firing stems from a social media post. A Venice High football player post was directed at Braden River High coach Kurt Bradley and included a spray tan bottle. Bradley is multiracial and took the tweet as being racially insensitive and complained to both the school district and Peacock. In a statement, Peacock says he liked the tweet because he thought it was a joke and he had no clue about Bradley's racial background. Peacock also went on to say, I'm appalled at Coach Bradley's desperate attempt to exploit today's racial tension to the disgrace he has brought to his program. Referring to the program's reprimand by the FHSAA due to illegal football practices prior to the start of the spring football season. Bill Buck Chevrolet in Venice are their signature sponsors. Monty Jacobs, representing the sponsor, admits he's a little perplexed on the significance of these tweets. You know, I'm a 50-year-old guy. I, social media, all these things, the way the kids communicate now. I mean, I'm, I I'm observe it sometimes and I see it. I can't say I'm involved and I'm certainly not an expert and I, I don't know how it affects people. Venice's principal, Eric Jackson, told us off camera it was a culmination of events that led to the decision of firing Peacock and ultimately wanted to go into a different direction in regards to the program. But Jacob says he still supports Peacock and the program. I'm not judge or jury. Um, I guess I'm an involved party because I support the program and I think that I support John, but also I support the Venice community and I support Venice High School. And this football program is going to move forward and Bill Buck Chevrolet is going to move forward with it. That's APC 7's Dwayne Lindo reporting. Now, according to Venice High School's principal, Coach Larry Shannon will be the interim head coach for the spring season. The school will then examine where they are and make a decision on its next head football coach.